What's up guys um i am going to be recording a video real quick where i have a conversation with pink Ward about the state of shaco um i reached out to him on this idea because i've been playing pretty much exclusively ad shaco uh i obviously i play ap shaco i've always played ap shaco uh as well but right now it didn't kind of seem like it was worth playing for me personally and i kind of wanted to hear his thoughts on the items because i haven't really dove into them at all um um i mean so for the basis of uh, ap right now ap sucks in terms of i think i like lane shaco sucks support shaco is pretty good just because support can function off of a lower amount of gold and ne doesn't need to and you can just cheese burn deal damage well Supports more of the um is more of like kite roll for your yeah, yeah. your ADC. You're just so that's why control. support is strong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why support is strong. But obviously, in low reload, people aren't going to take a take advantage of Shaco's weaknesses. So that's even more why he's like fifty two, fifty three percent win rate in low elo. Well, well, um, the items that he can abuse from support, I feel like they can't translate the junk. Like you can't clear and scale well into the game. It doesn't matter if you don't scale. Yeah. With Imperial mandate. Whatever, yeah. Like you're just playing a one shot and be annoying early. And then you just spam boxes. AP Shaco jungle can't really do that. Like I think Imperial mandate is an S tier item on Sh AP Shaco, but you can't really play that in solo lane. And it's kind of hard to play that on jungle. I don't think it's that bad. I haven't, I haven't tried it, but, Mandate was was well, good. last like last yeah week, last right? split yeah mm -hmm. um it's I I think it's fine on Shaco Jungle it's just the clear issues I think next patch whenever they buff the clear early I think actually rushing Mandate might be pr are they buffing decent the I on even paid attention what are they doing um so they're uh the next nerf they're gonna do is they're nerfing mana again but they're buffing uh. They're buffing boxes damage to monsters. It's going to be whatever it is now up to 20 to no 80. Way. Okay, they're going to overbuff Shaco here. It's literally going <clears> to... <throat> AP Shaco jungle is going to... That's crazy that they're buffing him. Because it's the same itemization as like when you see the Orianna and the Syndra. Like all these control mage that you're not seeing being picked because everyone's playing a Kali Fizz that are just abusing like the one-shot items that are mm. strong. The second that they adjust the items back to where Syndra Ori, because they're going to, right? Like, it's inevitable. Like, they love those champions. I feel like Shaco's going to return with them. So if he gets a well, clear buff too, it's going to be, like, really good. Next patch, they're um, changing the alternator items. They're uh, the Malignants, Ludens, and whatever the other one is. Um, whatever. Storm Surge, I think. They're all losing the scaling power and just being flat to begin with so they're going to be better in the early game um so it's kind of like you don't want to build multiple multiple of them um yeah i just found a problem which, finding haste for ap i couldn't get haste all the items that i wanted didn't have haste on them anymore for ap shago yeah you want leandries and you want like honestly shadow flame isn't terrible um does that have haste on it no, uh, you, you say no. no, no you, you were saying that all the items that you would want on AP Shaco this season yeah. don't have haste on them. Right. Um, yeah, I mean those two items. See, I didn't like demonic last season, and Leandri's this season is just demonic last season. It's like the Why same stat like line. Demonic? Um, it didn't give CDR basically, and I know there was like. You hit the cap of it, and then like you would want demonic like third item. Well, no, you guys were running its second item. Oh, I wasn't. I didn't like going its second. I would go co like. Oh, that felt terrible. Um, I would go cosmic drive second item. Yeah, cosmic. Or um, use. playing yeah. top lane. Yeah, I'm with you. Um, we know how the right the right haste combo feels. Yeah, but everyone was going demonic second item. They would go Leandri's into demonic, and I just didn't like demonic. Yeah, so I didn't build it at all. I would go cosmic into either void staff or rabbitons. I guess yeah, because once you get to that stage, you usually just have to. Yeah, a lot of times I ended up 
because once you get there, it's like you need something else. But yeah, so it kind of it was hard to itemize demonic, and you didn't really have HP to like like you wouldn't get the AP spike either because you didn't have HP on your items. Um, I don't like that this season cosmic doesn't have a. Uh, it doesn't have more AP and it has HP on it. It kind of feels eh to use. It it's like, like 80 and then... way too hard with, with removing haste from like the select. Like it feels like they try to take it from control mages and not like the AP assassins and I don't really understand what the goal was. Well, the AP assassins don't need it because they do one round of burst. But then okay. they still get it. Yeah, I don't get it. <laughs> they like, still I... get it because they get... They go Lich Bane, which has 15 on it. Um... I mean, they they don't go storm surge. Uh, sorry, they do go storm surge, but it doesn't have CR on it. So um, there's no point in playing the scaling champs that need items. Just one shot at all stages with a call. So I feel like Shaco right now feels how a lot of the mages feel in general because on yeah. third item he feels fine, but the game ends on your first item right now. Um, and that's the that's the, the base game issue. Last a lot longer though is what I've known. I've been taking Gathering Storm. I feel like every game is thirty minutes, no matter what. It's like I get what you mean, but it also just takes thirty minutes to end, even if you can't play for the thirty minutes. <laughs> well, yeah, well, that's the point. Like the yeah. it does take that much time. The other people are going to be on three items though at thirty minutes, while you're still stuck on two because you've been put behind so much in the early game. Like AP Shaco's clear is two too slow to get to three items when i like yeah but yeah i think the biggest issue with shaco is that uh, ap shaco jungle's biggest issue is you want to go a mandate type of item that has cdr on it but you need to go leandri's which doesn't have cdr damage. to be able to clear effective and be useful too yeah you see was, i was thinking mandate I was thinking mandate would be okay in the jungle because <clears throat> so even without the clear stuff in a gank scenario i think mandate would be okay well, like the you're with the items right now it's like if i was if i was just forced to play ap like i was just mindset on it i wouldn't even i wouldn't go nearly andrews at all because once you build like ludens for example uh, it feels like you're kind of forced onto okay I, i'm playing for burst i'm playing for the one i'm gonna go lich bane into death cap or whatever you know like because there's no point in, in kind of going burst kind of going the you know leandry's scaling build like you may as well just commit to it you know well the the leandry scan well so are you talking about from ap jungle point of view yeah yeah i i don't think you can build malignus as jungle and that's the item that like shaco like once no, it's not bugged anymore. It's just it doesn't do that much damage in Shaco. You get a lot of ultis out, but it, like you can have two ults in a fight, like at the beginning of a fight, um, and then it you you have like a twenty second ulti timer basically. Um, but like what I'm doing is malignant into Leandri's into Crypt Bloom, are another CDR item if I don't need to go vo uh, a void staff item. Um, I don't know any of these items. Crypt Bloom is the Void Staff equivalent. It's slightly cheaper, a little bit less pin, but has CDR on it and heals teammates. Oh, it heals. Oh, I played against the little Sandra with that. It was ridiculous. Yeah. Yeah. It's just a big AoE heal. Um, so I go that item. That item is, like, fine, but definitely a third slot item type of deal. Um... Like, I, mean, I, I expect an item like rehaul. Like, I think they're going to redo AP items. Probably. Like, the build path for... So, Flock said that on Shaco, you would want to go Leandri's into Cosmic Drive. But I, I just don't... You can't first item no haste. You just can't. It feels so bad. Yeah. Especially jungle. And I don't think you can go Cosmic Drive because I don't think that item ever fits in, like, the build path that you want. No. It doesn't have any damage for you. Yeah. Because, like, think about la like, last patch, every uh, like, all the Shaco players were going Leandri's into Demonic. I mean, that's not going to fill up the same niche you want to go into this patch. 
like uh, that's that the last patch. Last split. We were both we both ran. We both abused it. Everyone's like, oh, you don't proc it, acid. It, I don't care. I get eighty haste from this item. I don't care. <laughs> what was the um, Leandri's? Uh, well, at the end of last patch, uh, you did proc it. Um, they like yeah, fixed you know it at saying. some point. Yeah, early in the patch. Um, Leandri's had the base damage that made it feel good, and now it just max HP damage in the early game sucks. Yeah. Like, there's so many times that <laughs> it doesn't feel like you kill people. <laughs> Being like, Leandre just doesn't feel good uh, early don't game. I understand why they take, they take the item. Leandre's was the most, it was the mythic with the ability haste, mythic passive on it along with the haste that was already on it. Like they go from being the most haste centric AP item or one of to taking all, I don't get why they do that. Yeah, no, I, I understand that too. Like there wasn't an item that slotted into where that was taken out. Yeah, they did the same thing with Nasher's Tooth where it had it had 20% CDR before haste was introduced. It had 20% CDR on it, which is like, I mean, what, like 40 See, haste or whatever, and then they just removed it entirely, and then, yeah. Yeah, now it's back on it. <laughs> I know, it's Maybe you go that, actually, like... But then it's like, why am I not maybe... playing AD? Yeah, exactly, yeah, yeah. AD well, I mean, you were going that for clear. Yeah. Well, and for clear like, it, it, like, uh, that, and then also jungle pressure, or like, a objective pressure. Yeah, I wanted to be able to fight when I was running that a long time ago. Yeah, then there's no point in like not just going AD. Yeah, I, 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 I get that. Um, and the same reason why you wouldn't go Lich Bane. And then like a lot of people like ask why you don't why you don't just go like burst AP Assassin on Shaco. One, the champion doesn't want you to do that, so like, you're kind of doing like you're like half assing you're just it. a budget ad in the play style yeah exactly completely, mm. completely different you can't play half the play style of one you lose out of the other yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. so whatever you're playing like you can't go burst ap and lich bane isn't an item that you want to build anymore uh especially because of that um so like you're bottlenecked into like Oh, that that's something that pisses me off. Horizon Focus was an incredible item on Shaco, in my opinion. And this season, it has the haste, it has the AP. Yeah. But his boxes can't proc the effect. <laughs> Why? Is it a bug or intended? No, it's intended. The uh, instep was the one who uh, remade Horizon Focus. Wow. Um, he said pets just don't proc it, or aren't supposed to proc it. Pets? This is my ability. What do you mean, pets? <laughs> We're talking about um, boxes? Are pets? Yeah, they they they're coded as pets. Um, they it, said that's that. Ridiculous. That's an error. So, did you see what they did to Horizon Focus? No. Um, so now you have to be. If uh, they have to be six hundred units away from you for it to proc on them, so it's like supposed to be only. Before it was a, uh, if you slowed them are. It, it was the 600 units, but also if you like immobilize slash slowed them, they would uh, get the bonus damage effect. But now it's only 600. They have to be 600 uh, units away from you. And then it does this like s stupid big AOE vision clairvoyance so it, effect. It takes, they don't want the item to be anyone with CC. It want, they want it to be like for ranged casters. Yeah, but I mean, even at that point, like... So, like, the way Shaco can proc it is if you use your ulti and, like, go out of that range and, like, it right. explodes. Or if you E them from max range. Because you, like, your E is, like, 625. Where you throw it or where, like, where you are when it hits? Like, if you E and then... It's where you throw it. Walking away. Oh, that's It's where point. you throw it. Um, and then boxes... It it. That's crazy. It's, um, it specifically says where you placed it. So where even if you walk away from the box, it reads it as oh you placed God, it only so dumb. three hundred meter or units away or whatever. That's so the dumb. Range. They're gonna pretend it's Which... intended, whereas they're not just lazy. That item would be like one of Shaco's best items. That like the only usable. It's twenty seven hundred gold, uh, ninety AP, and twenty ability haste, and increases ten percent damage. Where are you placed? And I mean. 
Can you get it to 600 if you like box over one of your boxes and it starts out? <laughs> I, I tried that. <laughs> no, yeah, you, you did. So like, okay, yeah. Well, like, hey, it doesn't work. Does it come? Like, no, it, it doesn't, doesn't work. work. Like, it doesn't work. work. <laughs> 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 We're going to bounce on like female shrooms. But this, yeah. <laughs> it's the useless champion version. Uh, That's um, funny. <laughs> they're, um, but yeah. That that item would be pretty good on Shaco, but it doesn't work. AP Shaco itemization, like what would you be looking for to to help Shaco in terms of like what what are you lacking right now for build path? Well, I mean, okay, so because so last patch or last season, Leandre was just like everything you wanted. It was damage, it was mana, it was CDR. And it scaled. Right? Yeah. Yeah, and it scaled. Um, Malignance is the mana and the CDR, but you don't get the damage. Right. Um, so that doesn't work for jungle, it doesn't work for lane. Um, and that's why support gets to, like, be able to play, because they don't need... Right. They don't have to go into this. Yeah. They, uh, a lot of support players go the Zack Zack item, that, that support item, that this one... It has 3% max HP, plus... It's literally Leandre's effect. This is what old Leandre's was, minus the 8%. It was like 50 plus 1% in their max HP, but... Whatever. Um, this item makes Shaco support okay. And then they just go straight into, like, Ludens for poke. Earns the and CDR. Them dealing 60 mana and reducing their MR. I didn't even notice that. It reduces their MR by... By 10 now that's it's clone boxes in clone explosion are the only way to proc that right yeah um and the cl the clone will proc it so the i think the explosion and the box so like if this dies it'll uh initially yeah. proc one and then when the boxes start attacking it'll proc it one more time what are you on right now? but zach zach's realm spike what what game is that what, I Wait, oh, item. I don't have the item. Whoops. Is this support? Yeah, that's the that's what comes out of the. Am I not sharing screen? Yeah, I'm you sharing were. screen. Sorry, I was on your stream instead of the. Um. Yeah, it comes from the support item. This is like why, uh, support works right now. Like support is okay. <laughs> like support's like fifty to fifty three percent win rate in low elo, yeah. while uh, like jungle doesn't get this item, so they don't have damage. Um, but yeah, uh, so the malignance, so this is able, like, uh, so malignance is good because if they, if you get it perfectly on top of them, they'll get CC'd in the zone. The boxes will get the, yeah. uh, benefit from less magic resist, but the, the entire issue is that it's not that reliable. Like you have to specifically get your clone yeah, you on have to rubber the band. enemy. You want to set up a box for it and like yeah. rubber band it into to where they. Yeah, I mean that makes sense. Yeah, but... it, it 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 it's good when it works, but like it doesn't work very often. Basically. Well, I feel like you can um, create a lot of those situations if you like yourself with the rubber band mechanic, just mm -hmm. playing around wherever your box is and looking for the explosion, just spamming the box. With them, but... See, for runes, I've been going back and forth between wanting to go domination with uh, ultimate hunter, and then by like a late game, I have like 130 ultimate playing, haste. Is this for top or support or both? This for top. Okay. I think support can also do it, but um, also in I I've been going back bet between that dom uh, domination tree, but also uh, inspiration tree, and I'm going biscuits with uh, the new rune. Because the new rune gets you to level 11 faster, so you get uh, your level up point faster in ulti. Yeah. So I, I've been like thinking about that as an idea. Like maybe maybe it's better than just going um, domination tree. Because by the time you're gonna get out of lane to get your ultimate haste stacks, you're gonna be level 11. So I, I'm I'm not sure like. The thought process on that yet 
If I could get to the point um, where, I don't know, Shaco, AP Shaco, especially jungle, it just seems like there used to be a definitive, like, two or three item spike where it's okay that you're kind of weak or useless early on because once you get there, you have a vi like visible spike where you're allowed to play the game. You're, you have your cooldowns are you're clearing efficiently. Like you become strong, and I just don't really yeah, see that once you completed, being a thing right now. Yeah, once you completed cosmic as jungle, you were good. Yeah, like Leandri's cosmic, you were like the so game was playable. Yeah. When you completed Leandri's, it was okay. Like you could take team fights. Yeah. But you felt good at your second felt, item. Yeah, it's the um, low state. Oh, yeah. This item just sucks. <laughs> I mean, that, that yeah. Is Luden's just bad? But it's or... like, well, it's like, wh how are you building Luden's? Like, so if this is your, if this is your first three items, right? Your third item, so you need to go Void Staff. So you're at Void Staff item. And now you're going to go Luden's? They made the um. No, it would be Ludens. I assumed it would be first if you're getting Ludens at all. Uh, okay, so the these two, I well, Storm Surge, Ludens, and I think also Hextech. Um, those three items and Malignants, those four items, they are all like wanting to be first buy items Why because the they're Malignants is just the Leandres. Because I can see malignance for for lane Shaco, I get it. You need the you need the like mana, um, but for jungle Shaco, if you if you do want the burst, what's the reason to yeah, yeah. go Ludens first? Yeah. So the uh, the issue is um, so the reason you so all of these items are want you to be first buy items. And uh, the reason for that is that they don't really scale. Um, okay. So on live right now, they have a little bit of scaling. It scales from like seven to twelve, but they made it a flat, <clears throat> a flat amount now. Um, that's like a. I mean, what are the changes? Like, what would the the Ludens into Malignant spike? Is it just doesn't feel good, or it's just not worth the? No, it's not enough damage. Like uh. Okay. These two items together, just, like, this isn't a damage, like, this is, like, I, I want to say this is more of, like, a, like, it looks like a it's kind of, like, wave here while also being, like, poke. Okay, so it's Corky, Xerath, friggin' support Shaco. It's, um, yeah, yeah so, yeah, it, okay. like, Ziggs, like, Oriana, things like that. Um... Malignance is like Malignance is a quirky item because it procs on yeah. every one of Quirky's ultimates. Karma uh, ridiculous. Yeah, yeah. So that was the thing with uh Shaco with Ultimate Hunter that I was going oh, yeah, was that you right. would yeah. yeah, you would get forty you would get forty haste for your ultimate here and then Ultimate Hunter is like thirty six, I think, or something. Um so you would basically have like an eighty CDR ultimate. Be, there just has to be a bit. It just doesn't seem that valuable as a first item for. I'm just thinking jungle because you don't really need the mana. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. To, no, exactly. I want to get it second. So what can I can I get first? That's going to give me haste. Going to give me damage. That'll synergize with malignance. End up doing damage late game without sacrificing your early game entirely. See, even there, like, I don't think you want to go Leandri's, like, first item yeah, on Jungle Shaco. Like, I, I would feel terrible. Nasher's. I don't and, know. <laughs> uh, that, yeah, no, that's, like, what I yeah. said earlier. Like, like I think Nasher's, Nasher's are the only thing. thing. I mean, you could go Lich Bane. I mean, that's... that's. Uh, at that point, it's like, I'd rather just have Nasher's. <laughs> and then what's the point of well, playing um, Shaco at all? I lose the value of not having to go yeah. in auto range. So... I like that. There's a thought where on AP Shaco you go Lich Bane first item. But then after that, what do you do? I don't know. I feel like by the time you get Lich unless you get it first, it's like the pro once you get Lich Bane, you already feel like you shouldn't have bought Lich Bane because you should just be scaling because <laughs> they already outscaled Lich Bane. Yeah. Um I think I would have to go Nash. So if like, I wanted to force AP, it would just be Nasher's malignance, like Leandry's death cap, I don't know. Yeah. 
That sucks, though. Well, what's <laughs> funny is um, <laughs> I, I was watching a SKT game the other day. Uh, it's kind of Were they playing specific to that champion. No, no, no. no. Um, Nico, uh, Faker was playing Nico, and he went uh, Crypt Bloom's second item. But that's on Nico, who has... Yeah, just well, uh, it's yeah. it's because Nico's fucking Q and E has such a high AP ratio. Her Q has like a hundred thirty percent AP ratio. When her ult is one of the best ults in the game. Yeah, I get the, Nico's Q I is. I see that item being decent actually, yeah. just simply in terms of like what what Shaco's playstyle ends up being when you get to mid game. I feel like it's just good. Yeah, because you'll that, definitely like, hit you it. You want to end up kind of just being a mid game team fighter slash area control champ you're not really fighting so like this kind of feels anyway. bad Dude. like this kind of like this is what i think you would want to go what is it but do? it doesn't feel good 70 30 magic pen Bro, they're so they, they piss me off with haste it literally feels like there was a dart board with and then they just had <laughs> darts that had a certain like 15 haste darts that they just threw at the dartboard and, and that's what that's what got haste like there's no consistency so like, or like <laughs> the biggest issue with going leon so like you want to go the cdr rune the eight percent but you need the attack speed for the early clear in my opinion right yeah, like what what do you really think about that not have it. I, I, I will i will always yeah attack speed on on jungle yeah clearing without it feels so bad so let's say you have these two items. You have the ten percent from uh, or ten from transcendence. So you're at like thirty percent or thirty five ability haste, which is like thirty three percent. Yeah. I mean, I guess I can just do this. Thank you, Riot. For so we're at twenty six percent. Um, with so like without this item, just with yeah. transcendence. So you're just twenty six with like base Leandres. I can see. Which before. Being, uh, Last patch, you would be at 50, because this would have 20, this would have 20, and then Transcendence would have 10. Okay, 35 is playable there, though. It, to be at that gold point, that actually could be an answer, is to do what you just did, where you buy, you go well, Ionian into Codex into Leandries. Well, mm, I mean... It's going to feel bad either way. What you, I mean... That's 15, and that's 750. Yeah, I mean, you could just play three of them, like, yeah. <laughs> so instead of going, instead of going Codex, you just buy four. You just buy four of them. Play the game, dude. They took away all my haste. I have 16 anal beads in my inventory. <laughs> So if you, let's say you have the ten, so you'd be at fifty-five. And then, I mean, what are you doing with all the anal beats? <laughs> uh, okay, that's ridiculous. I can see a couple. I can see sitting on a couple, maybe two. Yeah. What, is, what does two look like? Yeah, I mean, two is two like is what realistic. you realistic. Sitting on three is, is like okay. What are we doing? Yeah. But I don't know if you would go. I mean. Into you could probably go malignants here. Is the like, build for Leandries right now? God. Seeing their oh. pretty dog shit. Why do they hate me? <laughs> that's so that's so gross looking. Because yeah, this it's, item it's is like so hard to make me pretty worthless early. Right now. Yeah, I'm not. Ugh. But like, I mean, this item like isn't terrible. Twenty three hundred gold. Yeah, it's cheap. That's why I think next patch, whenever boxes... So boxes here are by, by bonus by monster damage, 20... 20, 20 like? Sorry. So this is plus 10. Bad. I could sit on 45 for a while. 45 doesn't feel terrible. So you would go this into Leandri's. Would you not want Malignant's more there? Um, I just don't think you're going to have the damage... A second item. I just feel like I don't think this. I mean, this is cheaper now because it's. Well, I mean, a hundred gold cheaper, but um, 
I don't think the CDR you're getting from this is going to outweigh the like damage you're going to get from Leandre's because you're just the CDR you're is damage though. An item, especially on AP where you can't kind of like sorry for jungle where you're not really allowed to always set up like when you're playing lane or support mm -hmm. where you can set up and kind of chill on a spot and control it for a while. Like you got to be clearing and doing all yeah. this. Like having that haste converts to damage pretty quick when you have but, an extra box or two. But the the issue is uh. Are you going to be able to clear your camps fast enough without Leandre's? I mean, with this buff, yeah. Seems oh, like yeah. It, to yeah. Make it to where we can just clear with our kit. Thank God. What, what is what is live Shaco? What do you mean? Like, is it up to 50? I don't even know. I, I've been doing... Two to yeah, it's up to long. 50. Even with... Even with um, the Tiamat edition, I found that 3 just feels better because the game is so like farm-centric now. Freak wants me to clear mm -hmm. the jungle and then clear grubs and then go home and do that again eight times instead of ganking, but... So it's 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 versus 20, 35, 50, 65, 80. Seems like they're so at max rank, you're getting 30 this more. Be, let this be your clear tool because they like weren't really doing that before. But I feel like you're going to need Leandre's to facilitate for that mid game clear that other people are going to have you know i don't think so with, with these buffs like if, you, if you're putting points into boxes with the buffs i don't think it's going to make a difference because i mean you do have the ratios where it's because i don't need to i mean a, I, once you get to two items i'm pretty much one-shotting with you know e box e on most camps smite makes the difference on the tanky ones it's pretty convenient. Because you could say it's clear speed, but it's like I, being able to box more, like getting the haste speeds up my clear as well. So I don't know. Yeah, I get it. God, it's just clunky. They have, I know it, dude. They're going to do a rehaul. There's no way. So you're thinking of going Imperial Mandate, Mandate into Malignance. Yeah, what does that look like? You have 60 hate. Oh, I have the. So much wait, I have this. Plus. Wait, I lied. I it's not plus ten. It's I I literally have the rune. Um, you have which rune? Oh, you have the CDR rune. Yeah, so it, it's not so it's plus 50, ten. It's fifty haste. Hold on. Uh, where's the stack? Yeah. Fully that stack didn't rune? fully stack. Oh, it's level. It's a level thing. I didn't even know that was an option. So what's your haste? So it's at eight. At level eight. Oh, With these them. three items, you're at sixty-five. So forty percent. I, I can sit on that for a while, especially because at that point we're getting. Well, this is us. three items. I mean, this is what yeah. twenty. Four so minutes, okay, twenty-three I'm minutes okay into the game. Pretty much being done with with haste for. At least the next full item, if not, you know, like I'm okay going Leandries into. I probably wouldn't, but. See, like this is the issue. When you're at this point in the game, you want void. You're gonna need to build void stuff. Yeah. Right. Yep. So like, do you want to go crit bloom or like you might as well just like? I guess it depends. On which one are you gonna game. go? You know, and like you go this item, you're at two ten AP, which like kind of feels bad. What's your AP with Landry's there? And obviously the health. Kind of well, I mean, it's just twenty more. Well, I mean. Here it's. I feel like you don't really do more. enough damage though. Maybe. So I think Leandry's third is, is going to be kind of necessity at the moment. Because like you're not going to do yeah, but if... regardless if they're building MR, you may as well. Yeah, I feel like. You See, that was the Leandry's. that was the thing before is Leandry's had the flat amount that it would do, so you would do damage to squishies, and like now you're not like with this build you're not doing damage to squishies. Can also, I the, the Hydra pink ward. Let me know. I did try proof. See, so this is where you would be, just sitting on these two items, and then you would get blue buffs, and maybe there might be. So you'd be on thirty percent. I think it's Nashers right now. For any chance for jungle, I think it would have to be Nashers if I even want. If, if well, you would get less. Items are going to be. There's just so much shit to clear that you just can't like. You need, yeah, I think you have to have Nashers if you want a shot. Um, 
Yeah, I mean, I could see Nashers into... What would you go? Um, probably... Uh, malignants? Like, honestly, yeah. you could just go Malignants and, like, more ulties. You would I mean, be able to auto-attack them more, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's just trying to be rounded out as possible while also... You have to have... I think Nashers will be a necessity because of how much... Like, you, you're just clearing the whole game. And then, like, objectives mm. and stuff, doing his AP Shaco jungle. Oh, yeah. But, but it's like, is Nasher. So, like, is Nasher's better than just going Imperial Mandate Leandries? It, it'll feel a lot better to build, and it'll feel. Yeah, when I'm sitting on. When I have boots and one item, yes, I want to have Nat. I want to be able to, to do anything outside of just, like, put boxes around the fight 30 seconds. Like, I want to be able to show up and, and sometimes actually fight. Or sometimes just show up and take the objective without, you know what I'm saying? See, like, I don't have time see, to, to be dancing around and doing all this. See, maybe you can go this with uh, Domination Tree second. Oh, wait, no, I guess you're going to go first. And then have uh, Ultimate Hunter. You have Ultimate Hunter. Oh, yeah. And then. I always take that on AP, though. And then you'll have blue buffs, so you'd be at, like, is it. 10 or is it 15? I can't remember. I feel like I would just rather have Malignant's Nashers than Nashers Landry's. Like, even if it's not realistic, like, reliable to always get, like, the, the ulti box explosion combo, like, at least I want to have the chance to, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yes, I want No, to. you would never go hybrid. Hybrid is not good. Inferior. We, we talked about that earlier. Why isn't hybrid good? Why isn't hybrid good? Yeah. Uh, just fucking, you're splitting your differences, basically. Right. It's like, you're not one. doing too much of the, yeah, yeah, yeah. I wonder how good this is. Okay. It's, it's how it's good Hallbreaker is. Pink Ward's hovering Hallbreaker. I, I gotta go. Well, no. Do you not read it? <laughs> no, I didn't, and I refused. Wait, every fifth attack against a champion and epic monster deals bad, extra yeah. damage. That's not Yeah, bad. yeah, but. For AD? Bro, every fifth is a lot. Like, Shaco's standard combo is two, maybe three auto attacks before you profane into E for AD. Like, if you're not killing them that fast, you're either dead, uh, they flashed away. Like, you're not getting five autos off. And if you are, I'd rather just have Bork anyways. Hear me out. I don't want you know. to. You go Ginsu's? Put, the, put, put, put them down. Put, put them down right now. You think for... He's oh, theory crafting on AD Shaco and he's a hole breaker. Okay, okay. I think well, the so the issue is that it stacks on yourself and not on the the yeah, that's, or that's on the, the issue. Yeah. No, 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 like seriously, this could be a good item if it if it worked with your clone. <laughs> I I trust you. I I'm with it. <laughs> Wait, actually, your clone getting hella blades could actually be good with this because your ult would just run them down. Is no, your ulti, uh... Because it stops to throw an E, Pink Ward. You ruined it. No, 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 no. Hear me out, bro. Okay. I don't want to. Um... Anyway. Anyway. I, GG's, I, I gotta it was good out. talking. I gotta head out. We it didn't really... Talking, bro. We didn't really make any points here. <laughs> we made a ton. We made a ton. <laughs> this has been... We... This is <laughs> concise and well-handled discussion about nothing that I've ever had. <laughs> we literally talked about nothing. <laughs> and I did. It was more just like <laughs> complaining and venting. Uh, this is what you get, okay, Rashaco players. They, they didn't expect anything to happen. <laughs> and on that note, have a good night. <laughs> Thanks for the conversation. Have a good night. I'll see you, brother. Peace. All right, guys, that's going to be it for me. Sorry, this is way longer than I meant it to be. Um, but, yeah, if you enjoy content this like this, I mean, that was fun. I always enjoy talking to Pink Ward. I, I wanted to give you guys, like, because I, I I don't know what the hell is going on with AP, so I wanted, I wanted to give you that perception, uh, his perspective. But, yeah, if you enjoy, drop a like, make sure to sub, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace, bros.